surgery for pseudo exfoliation and cataract pupil dilates to about 6 mm a sclerocondyl tunnel is created and through the tunnel floor entry technique rexis is being done with this technique the tunnel remains closed the entry is through a pinpoint at the limbus through the floor of the tunnel so there is no loss of visco elastic and you will be able to do a comfortable consistent circular rexis and you can enlarge it whenever you feel like there is a need tropical anesthesia plus intracameral ignocaine one percent is injected into the entry chamber few drops are good enough good one point hydrodissection with a special cannula there is a floppy iris as you can see now the most important thing is in pseudo exfoliation is to maintain the integrity of the zonules and this technique amazingly maintains all the zonular tissues there is no pull or push on the zonules at any one point of time the nucleus remains in the center it is rotated into the entry chamber once you're sure it's outside the capsular bag then only you take the wire vectors to support the back of it if you take it before that there is a possibility of zonular tears as well as posterior capsular tears epinucleus is expelled with visco cortex is aspirated at no point of time there is any stress or strain on the zonules throughout the surgery this is uh, good even for subluxated uh, zone subluxated cataracts there is no need to put the endocapsular ring as you are not pressurizing the entry chamber as you are not manipulating the nucleus within the capsular bag the entire uh, cortical aspiration is done using right and left simco cannulas along with the help of the straight cannula there is only one channel and the lens is placed and ensure that it's placed inside the capsular bag. All lenses are compatible with this technique as there is no zonular disruption. Aspirate the entire viscoelastic from behind and in front of the lens in the capsular bag and the amount that is stuck on the back of the endothelium and that's the end of the surgery. Tinon's can device closed with fibrin glue. Thank you.